This free step-by-step -step video comes to you directly from Haynes. You can complete more than 200 jobs on this vehicle when you purchase the complete Haynes online manual at haynes.com. Reach under the driver's side of the face here and pull the release handle rearwards. Lift the safety catch and open the bonnet. Unclip the support prop and engage it with the slot in the underside of the bonnet. The engine oil level dipstick protrudes from the engine cover, whilst the oil filler cap is located under a flap in the cover. Withdraw the oil level dipstick and wipe it clean. Fully reinsert the dipstick, then withdraw it again. Examine the oil level on the dipstick. If the level is near or below the minimum mark, more oil is required. If topping up is necessary, lift the flap in the engine cover, clean the area around the filler cap, then unscrew it. Using a funnel to minimise spillage, add the correct grade of oil to bring the level up to the full or maximum mark. Check the level on the dipstick frequently as oil is added. Do not overfill. Approximately one litre of oil is required to bring the level from the minimum mark to the maximum. When the level is correct, reinsert the dipstick, securely refit the oil filler cap, and close the flap in the cover. The coolant expansion tank and filler cap are located at the rear of the engine compartment. With the engine cold, the level should be up to the mark indicated on the side of the expansion tank. If topping up is necessary, unscrew the filler cap and add a 50-50 mixture of antifreeze and water to bring the coolant level up to the mark. With the level correct, securely refit the filler cap. The brake fluid reservoir is located on the right-hand side of the engine compartment. The fluid maximum and minimum levels are indicated on the side of the reservoir. If topping up is required, Wipe clean the area around the filler cap, then unscrew it. Add dot 4 fluid as necessary to bring the fluid level up to the maximum mark. Refit and securely tighten the filler cap. Remember to mop up any spilled fluid. The power steering fluid reservoir is located at the front of the engine compartment. The levels should be checked with the wheels in the straight ahead position and engine turned off. Unscrew the filler cap from the top of the reservoir and wipe all fluid from the cap dipstick with a clean rag. Refit the filler cap, then remove it again. Note the fluid level on the dipstick. When the engine is cold, the fluid level should be between the upper and lower marks on the dipstick. When the engine is at normal operating temperature, the fluid level should be up to the upper mark on the dipstick. If topping up is necessary, add the correct grade of fluid to bring the level up to the upper mark on the dipstick. Securely refit the filler cap. The screen wash fluid filler cap is located at the front of the engine compartment. If topping up is necessary, pull up the filler cap and add a mixture of water and screen wash additive to the reservoir. With the reservoir topped up, press the filler cap down firmly to close it. Disengage the support prop and clip it into place on the slam panel. Close the bonnet firmly and check it secure.